Okay, everybody. Now I'm just reading in, of, of the in the in the video I made a minute ago. I told you guys I said I wish Lance was here. Sure enough, Lance showed up. I baptized <laughs> these. Hey, Lance, real quick. What is the verse? I, where did I baptize you, Lance? You remember? North Beach. North Beach. And do you remember the verse I gave you that day? Oh, I don't know what it was. You remembered it. We're seated with him in heavenly places. That was Ephesians in Christ. Joe, where's your? You got a scripture? Let me. Said that. That get I alone and the most high at the right hand of the Father. Get show me the tattoo. Show me Lance. Show me your tattoo, Lance. I know it's not. I don't want to do that. Okay. Come on. It's Psalms. Where is it? Steal my name. Again. Is it the one with the psalm? Is it the one with the psalm? Psalms. Okay, let me look at it. Twenty-eight verse twenty-three. Okay, that's it. I've seen these before. Hey, that's cool. My, bro. though I walk, even though it's a little change, I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I will, I will fear, fear no evil, for I am the meanest mother effort in the valley. Now that's a little ta that's a little different translation, but that's the way that they would have said it in these days and times. I got I turned Actually, it on because right after scripture. Okay, Cameron. You don't change scripture. Cameron, uh, <laughs> let's see, Austin's eating hot dogs. You will get, be cursed. They, these were some scriptures Cameron was started reading. Now you're seeing a little give a word to the people, Cameron. You're on video. The, then he remembered the days of old Moses and his people saying, Where is that? He brought them up out of the sea that the shepherd of his flock, with the shepherd of his flock. Where is he that put his Holy Spirit within him, that led him by the right hand of Moses with his glorious arm, dividing the water before them to make himself an everlasting name, that led him through the deep as a horse in the wilderness, that they should not stumble. As a beast goeth down into the valley, the Spirit of the Lord caused him to rest. So didst thou lead thy people to make thyself a glorious name. He's talking about... Jesus making a way for Jesus to come. What, cha down what chapter heaven. are you reading? This is Isaiah uh, still. It's 63. Okay. I just picked it up and drive. Doubtless thou art our father through Abraham. He be, be ignorant. Doubtless thou art a, our father through Abraham. Be ignorant of us. The Israel acknowledges not. Thou our Lord art our father, our redeemer. Thy name is from everlasting O Lord, why thou, why hast thou made us to err from thy ways and hardened our heart from thy fear? Return for thy servant's sake the tribes of thine inheritance. The people of thy holiness have possessed it but a little while. Our adversaries have trodden down thy sanctuary. We are thine. Thou art bear, thou never bearest rule over them. Thy, they were not called by thy name. Okay. Show me that Bible. Hold it up. Tell me where this you got. This Bible is like from 1940, right? No. Where'd you get it from? From you. You gave me this Bible. And John gave me this Bible. And you gave a it to... When I first met him in the, in the halfway house. And the Bible's little, still around. Read, go to Isaiah 61. 30 years. Go to 61 and read the beginning of that. Okay. The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me because the Lord had anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. He has sent me to bind up the broken heart and to proclaim liberty to the captives and the opening of the prison to them that are bound. To proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord, the Lord and the voice. day of vengeance of our God, to com comfort all that mourn. To appoint unto them that mourn in Zion, to give unto them beauty for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness, that they may be called trees of righteousness, the planting of the Lord, that he might be glorified. And they shall build the old ways, they shall raise up the former desolations, they shall repair the waste cities, the desolations of many generations. It says, Bishop... What is that? Ruin? Hey, let me throw this in. I forgot. Listen, on the last video, on the last video you saw, I was just doing it like off the cuff. Yeah. Faith of mustard seed. I had, listen, now let that, faith of mustard seed, that's a verse. Listen, I had an old Bible, not this one. When I came to Texas with a friend from New Jersey, I gave my friend the Bible. Faith of mustard. Oh, there's the mustard. Faith is ground mustard seed. What is that? Cameron, listen, you're gonna like it. Mild sauce. I you're gave I gave the Bible. Soulmate. I gave <laughs> I gave the Bible to a friend of mine. Oh my goodness. From New Jersey. Jesus, don't you, Bubba? And my friend from New Jersey went back to New Jersey and died of AIDS. Uh-uh. Yes, and I got the Bible back. And that Bible, I still have it. And you know, a few years ago I opened it up and he wrote notes in it. And one of the notes, God speaks to me through the notes because he was a friend of mine. I led him to the Lord, Miguel. 
And one of the notes said, the presence of contrary winds does not mean you're out of the will of God. Do you know what the other note I read that he wrote the other day in Revelation? It says, repent, repent or you will die. He wrote that. Do you know he died after he wrote that? But that was a note he wrote on the side. He was studying it years ago, and he put, repent or you will die. Sure enough, he died. It's amazing when I read that old Bible because those little notes speak to me. It's those amazing how I have, can't find my anointing oil because I put it somewhere and I exactly know where I put it, but someone moved it. Okay, so the verse, the, huh? the baptism verse no. was, we are seated okay. with him in heavenly places in Christ. Hey, guess what? Listen, Lance knows uh, the daughter of one of the friends I grew up with. And it's amazing. He was going to go, uh, a f uh, two years ago or a year ago, I gave Lance a ride. Best friend I've ever had. I, was, I gave Lance a ride. That's awesome. And I was dropping him off at the hospital. I guess you, I forgot what happened that time. He, he had to go to the hospital. It wasn't me, it was my friend. Yes, but he knew. He had a rotator disc. Uh, oh, yes, yes. I was dropping off a friend. And he knew I was going to New Jersey on a trip. And I told, he mentioned he, Lance lived in Pennsylvania and he had a girlfriend in New Jersey or Seaside Heights. I said, I used to hang out there. I won't mention the name, but the father was a friend of mine. Huh. The father of the girl was a friend of mine. I said, I know him. And sure enough, all right, everybody, that was just a little. That was really good. I that was that. just a little thing. Oh, I'm going to tell. Wait, I'm going to tell this story. Thing. Lance, I'm going to tell this story. <laughs> the guys know I'm an Italian. And if you see I'm me wear, Italian. you see me wearing that leather jacket. Sometimes, Italian. sometimes the guys think John's. John's a mafioso connected, you know, he's an Italian from New Jersey. Well, this, that's kind of a funny story. I'm going to tell it. One, I miss that girl a lot. One, one day, Lance, I used to do a ha uh, Bible study at the halfway house. And one day, Lance was having a little rough night. And he said, I think John's in the mob. And, <laughs> and uh, Angel was giving Lance a ride, and Angel said, no, let's go. I to, remember you saying no, that listen, shit. I was listen, there. Listen, listen to this, and then we're going to end this. So anyway, Angel <laughs> said, yes, I gave Lance a ride, and I told Lance, let's go to John's house. That was a confusing And day. Lance kept saying, no, he's in the mob. And I told Angel the next day as a joke, I said, I'm glad you didn't come over. I was having a meeting with the bosses that night from New York. <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me, John. All right, that's it. Video's off. I wanted you all to see.